back to the channel uh, I have to give some tips before starting this lab so uh, first of all uh, this is a document link uh, which we need in the in this lab and I will be provide this link in, in the description box of the lab and if you have if you guys face the uh, error or uh, problem while accessing the lab I request you to please go to the YouTube channel and search for go to the short section there I have create one shot that how to access that link okay any link because uh, what happened you guys uh, log in with your uh, personal credentials uh, on the incognito mode and because of that incognito mode you cannot uh, you don't have access to uh, open the uh, document and second thing is uh, my recommendation for you to please first of all watch the video carefully uh, and so that you can rememberize the steps uh, and uh, that will help you to complete the lab without any uh, error because in the last uh, because in the last task it might take around 5 to 6 minutes sometimes it take 2 to 3 minutes but sometimes it take 5 to 6 minutes so you my you guys mu must have like some minutes buffer to complete that steps so yeah that's my recommendation for you first of all watch the full video and then try to do the lab okay so just wait for the few uh, few minutes like uh, one to two minutes uh, it will give you the credentials for the lab and after that we will start the lab so it's done now now copy the lab and just log in with you continue Okay, so once you log in with your credentials, so first of all search, uh, just agree the uh, terms and conditions. Search for the first of all, search for the BigQuery, open this in new tab and then say search for the cloud function. Okay, so yeah, open both the uh, things in new uh, other tabs. Okay, then click on the add data and here you can see connect, uh, connection to the external data source. Okay, uh, if you can't find over here. You can search over here also but most of the time it's present over here now scroll down a little bit copy this name and click on this in the connection type search for big leg and remote function and paste the name over here and click on create connection so when we have done with task number one now copy this name then click on these three dots create database and data set id so we have done with two tasks okay now for the third task first of all go to the notepad copy this my connection and as we done in task number one click on this add data again connection from here choose big leg and remote function and replace the name over here please pay attention on task one it's my dash connection and now it's my connection okay please make sure of that you create two connection okay so once you're done with this thing uh, as i told you please open the cloud function also now click on this remote add and then go to trigger and copy this url okay then go to the notepad or if you have any other uh, things a text editor you can use that now please carefully uh, replace this uh, link with this uh, copy trigger url okay so like this make sure you do not give any extra space so otherwise you will face the issue now copy this thing go to your big query in editor run this query so it's done now click on run so uh, please wait until you get query completed like this kind of error uh, output so once you're done with this then go to your cloud function click on this edit button then click on simply click on next and here we have to make these changes so copy this thing simply and run over here remove this and paste this and click on deploy so that's the thing we have to do and now if you just go to the lab instruction you can see i have six uh, 16 minutes left okay so one more thing if you just click on this check my progress 
you will get uh, uh, which task you have not completed yet okay so just wait for a few seconds and you will get uh, like uh, some kind of error because uh, i saw in the uh, previous game in the cloud uh, sandbox lab uh, so here you can see invoke the revoice cloud function to incre uh, increment this kind of art uh, arbitrary values in bigquery you, we are getting this kind of error why because the task uh, fifth task is not complete yet so that's a, that's a how you can th that's a way you can uh, find out the on which task you are getting the error okay so as as i was saying uh, like last uh, on last game uh, i saw you guys face the issue on the uh, sandbox lab because that lab uh, was very old and i haven't used my voiceover so i thought i must use the voiceover for this lab okay so just wait for a few minutes and it will be done and if you guys like the video please give it one thumbs up so now you can see this uh, i got a green tick now just keep clicking on check my progress so now you can see i got a full score okay if you guys have any doubt please let me know in comment section i will be more than happy to help you and if you like the video please give one thumbs up thanks for watching have a good day guys